Apple will launch its iTunes radio service this autumn. As the leaves start turning color and students head back to school, we could be listening to a different tune in the streaming music space. Apple debuted iTunes Radio at the Worldwide Developers Conference in San Francisco. After plenty of anticipation and speculation, the radio service was finally announced. The pioneer of internet music sales is entering a crowded arena. Apple joins All Access, Rhapsody, Spotify, and Pandora. iTunes Radio brings free streaming music, but with ads. For ad-free music, it will cost users $24.99 a year with a subscription to iTunes Match. Over 200 stations will be featured along with access to an endless catalog of songs. Other notable Apple launches that will coincide with the back-to-school season include the new iOS 7. It is getting a makeover with a brand new user interface and new features. Apple also introduced AirDrop, which lets users share content and information with friends and contacts who are nearby. And Mavericks, the new Mac software, was unveiled at the WWDC. iCloud Keychain is part of the new OS and combines security with convenience. The developer's preview of Mavericks showcased a plethora of new features. Users will be able to download the OS in the autumn. Meanwhile, Apple previewed the next-gen Mac Pro that boasts improved design and architecture. It is expected to be available later this year.